Hey there, welcome back to AquaCloud channel. Today we are diving into the exciting world of software testing and quality assurance metrics. You know, in the fast-paced realm of development, there's one golden rule we can't ignore. You can't improve what you can't measure. And that rule definitely applies to quality assurance. Just Imagine the software we are producing is growing exponentially, and as lines of code multiply, so do the potential defects. That's why it's crucial to prepare our QA team for the challenges ahead. We need effective bug reporting tools, and we must also understand which metrics can give us a clear picture of our quality assurance efforts. To start off, we need to answer some crucial questions to determine which metrics suit our specific needs. How long will it take to test? How much will it cost? Is it reasonable to use low-cost tests? What's the severity of the bugs we encounter? These questions lay the foundation for selecting the right metrics for our testing process. Once we have those answers, we can explore a range of essential metrics to track our progress. Remember, these metrics aren't one size fits all. Every business has different needs, but we can find tools to assist us. In my team, we use the AquaCloud reporting features and the report with art for tracking our metrics. With Aqua, we can identify the criteria that matters to our business. We can create different scenarios, compare that data types, and generate comprehensive reports that guide our decision-making process. It's like having a testing assistant right at your fingertips. Let's dig into some specific key metrics that you definitely need to know about everyone needs to know about. First up, we have the absolute numbers. These metrics give us a general overview of our testing process. We track the total number of test cases, the number of cases passed, failed and blocked, as well as the number of defects found and their acceptance status. Next, we have test execution and bug fixing metrics. These metrics help us understand how our completed tasks affect the overall quality. We look at test completion status, defect density, priority, acceptance, and rejection. By analyzing this data, we can pinpoint critical errors and address them promptly. Moving on to test design metrics. Here we evaluate the correlation between test cases and requirements. We aim to identify gaps in functionality and assess the productivity of our test design process. This gives us a deeper understanding of our test coverage and help us deliver a more reliable product to our end users. Now, Let's talk about user acceptance testing metrics. These metrics are crucial for discovering missed issues and gaps in our testing strategy. We need to ensure our product meets the expectations of our users before it hits the market. And hey, we can't forget about product exploitation and support metrics. These metrics help us fine-tune our testing performance and evaluate the effectiveness of our defect removal process. We want to address any undiscovered issues before our products goes live. There is also the cost of testing to consider. We need to assess the allocated cost, the actual cost, budget variance, time variance, and even the cost per bug fix. Understanding these economics metrics allows us to optimize our testing process and 
allocate resources efficiently. Lastly, we have overall testing metrics. These metrics provide us with a holistic view of our test strategy's effectiveness. We evaluate effort variance, rework effort ratio, requirement creep, and test reliability. They guide us towards making necessary improvements and achieving high testing standards. That's all for today's video. I hope you've enjoyed diving into the world of software quality assurance metric with me. Remember, Measuring is the key to improving our testing efforts and delivering top-notch products to our clients. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button for more exciting content on software testing and development. Until next time, stay passionate and keep testing like a pro!